Dazzling beautiful lights and high electricity bills. It must be the annual Candy Cane Lane celebration. Jenna Coburn takes us there for all the fun. It's a holly jolly Christmas and the best time of the year. We're here on the 1200 block of East Acacia Avenue for the annual opening of Candy Cane Lane. The night kicked off with the El Segundo Community Band playing Christmas hits for everyone to enjoy as the anticipation of Santa's arrival was drawing near. This year marks the 63rd house lighting ceremony at the Candy Cane Lane in El Segundo. Families and friends from all over the South Bay joined us as Santa Claus rode down the street in a lit up fire truck. Santa was surrounded with loyal believers as he departed from the truck. He then walked the pitch black street of East Acacia Avenue, shouting the three little words that makes the house lighting so special. After the 26 houses that make up Candy Cane Lane were all lit up, it was time for Santa to take a seat in his sled and greet each child one by one. I'm kind of into scootering, so I kind of want a new scooter this year. Think you're going to get it? Hopefully. Kids lined up from 7 to 9 for their moment to sit on Santa's lap and tell him what they wished for. Even I had a chance to tell Santa what I wished for. For other children, they were excited about something else. What do you look forward to every year coming to Candy Cane Lane? Um, just seeing the lights and pretty much seeing all the cool houses. The residents that take part in making Candy Cane Lane come to life have a different joy of their own. The crowd following Santa and just ooing and aahing every house left and right. It just brings tears to my eyes every year it does. Homeowners take a good amount of time to prepare for this marvelous event. Some take up to almost a month to make sure their light fixture is above and beyond. We start thinking about it, honestly, the day that we take it down. Easier ways to put it away, what we're going to do different next year. And we get out here the day after Thanksgiving and we go day and night. Candy Cane Lane has been open to the public since 1949 and has every intention of exceeding everyone's expectations. Every day you work on it a little bit, a little bit, and usually you work up to the 11th hour right before it starts. The magnificent lights will sparkle the street of East Acacia Avenue for many more years to come. Merry Christmas! Reporting for El Segundo TV, I'm Jenna Coburn.